Providing a second chance, thousands of people nationwide each year receive blood transfusions to save their lives. Our annual summer blood drive just ended a few minutes ago outside the station, and one man told WYMT's Lauren Osborne he knows all too well how important it is. She joins us now live. Lauren? Steve, I've been out here since around 2.30 today, and I've seen dozens of people. Leaders say they've had 28 people come through to donate blood. One man I spoke with says a car crash drives him to give back. The blood mobile is back at WYMT. So how about helping people? For one man waiting in line, it's personal. Because I was in a car accident and stuff, and I needed blood when I was in the hospital and stuff, so I mean, it's, it's all about donating. He says the crash changed his outlook on life. I mean, any, anything that somebody could do to help somebody, I mean, that that's, can't go wrong there. Leaders with Kentucky Blood Center say every day centers across the state collectively need at least 400 people to give blood. They say it's easy to do and one person can help up to three people. We never want to have a situation where we don't have enough blood supply for those patients in need. So every day of the week we are out in the communities uh, asking people to donate blood. There's God's, everybody's God's children, you know what I'm saying? He wants us all to live. An average blood drive usually collects around 25 units of blood. Steve, uh, leaders say summer is the slowest time of year to give blood, and they encourage everyone to give blood as much as they can. If you want to see when the next blood drive is, you can visit our website at WYMT.com. All right, glad to hear we beat the average today, Lauren. Thank you very much, and we want to thank all those that came out to donate, including some of our own employees.